加拿大国会外交事务国际人权委员会副主席考特勒发出了新闻公告，说他在中国新年期间在加拿大议会成交，并且宣读了六份。关于中共活摘法轮功学员器官的请愿书，要求加拿大政府采取措施制止中共暴行。We are concerned about the cruel practice of forced organ harvesting by the Chinese Communist regime on prisoners, including Falun Gong practitioners, resulting in the deaths of some tens of thousands, as documented by David Maitis, David Kilgore, and Doctors Against Forced Organ Harvesting. Cutler 要求加国政府采取措施制止中共活摘法轮功学员器官的暴行。He's calling the government to take measures to end the Chinese regime's practice of killing Falun Gong practitioners for their organs, to amend Canadian legislation to combat forced organ harvesting, and to publicly call on China to end its persecution of the Falun Gong. 律师出身的 Cutler 代表过多位著名的政治犯。九九年任议员后，他义务为因修炼法轮功而被劳教的张昆仑等人做法律顾问。他指出，中共对法轮功的迫害根本上违反了中国的法律。They have been violations of universal human rights as well as being violations of international treaties to which China is a state party, as well as being violations of their own Chinese law itself. Cutler 一贯赞扬法轮功真善忍的价值。他影响了很多议员来关注中共对法轮功的迫害。Of truthfulness, of compassion, of forbearance, of tolerance, and spirituality, which are not only ancient Chinese values but are universal values. 近年来 ，Cutler 提出私人法案，要求加拿大禁止国民去中国进行器官移植手术。他希望羊年为在中国的良心犯和政治犯带来自由。I trust as well that this year, this year of the goat, may see also their release. 新唐人记者周立敏、渥太华报道。